Hello, hello, hello. This is Jenna Cantor, performer and physical therapist. I am the founder of Powerful Performer. Okay, so doing an interview today with some really great leaders in the private practice world who live here in New York. I'm very excited to be bringing them on. And just give us a second as we're connecting. I'm not going to say anything. I'm going to pretend as though it doesn't say in writing exactly who I'm interviewing because it just it feels if I, I feel this like ah, when I do it that way <laughs> so maybe it's just around my own personal perspective but hey it's exciting so yeah the conference is going to be this Saturday at Hunter College $20 if you're a member of NYPTA, which is APTA, and $30 if you are a non-member. Ooh, I see, I see, yep, adding you on, adding, adding. Um, seriously, it's gonna be the cheapest, the cheapest conference you'll ever, you, it will pretty much bump up quite quickly. Hey! Yeah. Hi. Hey, what's up? Oh my gosh, I love it, you guys have the headphones. Oh, I'm gonna pretend my husband's here and go like this. Like, <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh it's so good to meet you guys virtually i love this oh so yeah bad. thank you for joining us samantha um so all right please introduce yourselves you go you go after okay. you hi everybody my name is rena eleazar i'm one of the founders of match fit performance um i've been practicing as a pt since 2014 and um, yeah, we're excited to talk to you all about how we developed our practice. I yeah. love it. And awesome. Yeah, I'm I'm Erwin Sugia, the, the the other half of Match Fit Performance. So, uh, yeah, we started practicing in 2013. Uh, we do a lot of work with athletes in the New York City area, two teams, namely uh, the New York Empire and Gotham Knights Rugby Football Club. And uh, we do a lot in terms of helping new PTs and uh, other PTs figure out how to brand and put their stuff together so that they look great and they can do their thing. Oh, so it's it's so perfect. It's so ideal that you're going to the conference because you, you also go beyond just your practice. Mm -hmm. you yeah. I love that. You guys are going oh, yeah. So what I really exactly. like about you too is that you are a doer with a yes. private practice. <laughs> now, mm -hmm. that is not an easy thing to do, but it is also a very beneficial thing to do. So if you are a person who's looking into starting your own thing and you're looking going solo, that is one way to go. But if you can find someone to partner up with, it's really in your best interest. One thing that pops into my mind off the top of my head, and I would love other thoughts on from you guys, is if you want to go on a vacation or if you're sick, the other one can cover for the other person. Um, yeah. what, what do you guys are benefits of doing a duo um, practice? So we actually, just the way that we work professionally yeah. kind of complements each other really well. So Erwin's very passionate about the branding and marketing side of it. And so when either of us have ideas, he's really good at putting things together and kind of making them um, into something that I can also understand, but um, something that's very like front facing and um, bringing people to get interest in it. And then um, on my side, I'm very analytical. I actually really love spreadsheets. So, oh. um, so working through, <laughs> working on <Yes>. ops, <laughs> working through operations and analyzing our data, um, whether it's whether it's on the money side or on visits or cancellation rates or things like that. Like I, I like to analyze numbers and look at that aspect of it. So between so you we, two, are you both into organizing, like a sock drawer? Who's the sock drawer organizer between you two? <laughs> you guys are such a good balance. I love that. Yeah. Sandra um, here. Hello, Sandra. She's the president of the private practice section. A great force. Oh, awesome. <laughs> Super yeah, cool uh, to have you on here, Sandra. What you were going to say, Erwin? Yeah, no, it, it's, it, it's good, especially if you plan, if you plan on – having somebody as a partner or even as a part of your team, it's really important to find and learn a lot about this potential partner's uh, like ability to function in, in a business. Uh, and we were lucky, we were just lucky enough to find that, you know, we, we are very complimentary in the sense that Rena loves spreadsheets. She loves numbers. I hate numbers. I hate documentation. Uh, and I will be the first to admit it, especially <laughs> as a practicing physio, like I hate documenting but this Rena holds me accountable awesome. keeps me grounded and then I'm the one that you know gets on Rena's back and I'm like Rena you need to post more on Instagram yeah, exactly like, Rena, <laughs> Rena 
Rena gets much more engagement on the Match Grid platform than I do, so uh, like we need to get pretty ladies on the on the on the Instagram platform as opposed to this ugly this ugly mug here. So, um, yeah, it's it's. Uh, we were lucky enough to be super complimentary, but for, and we're going to talk about this at the, on the panel yeah. on Saturday. So don't give too, too much. Don't give too much. Yeah. But, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so I mean, com having a complimentary or even like a good uh, symbiosis slash uh, relationship uh, with whoever you plan on working with, you pl if you plan on doing your own, putting together your own practice is really, really important. I love this. I'm, I'm so happy we got you. I remember when we were figuring out who to ask. Um, to come to speak and your names came up I hadn't heard of you guys yet and so oh, I, awesome. I feel so lucky that I got to be in the room where I was like oh you got to check him out and so I did and I'm like oh my gosh these guys are amazing <laughs> so um, I'm yeah. really grateful that you guys have been able to come and you're going to be able to share your wisdom and help out all the students which is great it's great. Yeah, yeah, that's we're excited. That's one of our big passions for sure. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and and you give you you provide stuff that isn't taught in school. So thank you, mm -hmm. thank you very much. Yeah, that's that was definitely as we were building our practice and learning all of these things. It was definitely a lot of wow. I wish we had more than one business class and Some, more than learning how to write a business plan right, and like, actually yeah. um, going into the true marketing and what that means yeah. and. Like learning how to pitch and learning. Oh how yeah, to have definitely heavy, learning how to pitch. Learning how too. to have heavy discussions. I have so many fun oh, anecdotes yeah. from uh, from when we started our practice in 2013, or started the side hustle in 2013, and I'll tell them on Saturday. Probably they're probably better served for the uh, the after party, but yeah, like, it's a. Uh, there's a lot of there's a lot that we had to learn, and there's stuff that we don't. Not that not that our educations in school are um, are super. Yeah. On, I guess there's a lot more that we need to learn, especially if people, if, if a lot of physios plan on going into private practice and uh, we are almost underserved, I guess, in that sense. And so that's what we've been trying to do. And we, you know, we got asked to go back to NYU. Or I reached, we reached out to one of our professors at NYU who, who did a business class, who would also be speaking, Dr. Weaver. Um, oh, nice. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, he's one of our favorite professors, but like we reached out to him and we were like, this is a really important thing. He's like, yeah. Like this is this makes so much sense. Why don't you come in? So you know, hopefully that's something that we would like to expand on, not just even at NYU, but also other other programs or other or even having like a mini conference for other PTs that want to do not not exactly what we did, but want to go out and start their own brand or start and do their own thing. Ah, oh, I love it. Oh, yeah. huge fan already. Wait, so people who joined us, hello, John, Vincent, Jay gave a thumbs up as you were talking. Hey, what's like, up, oh, cuz? Oh, awesome. Yeah. So already, yeah. already got plenty of support and fans. Mary Lou, hello, oh, yeah. my friend Mary Lou. She's a private practice owner herself. Yeah. So, awesome. Yeah, thank you guys for coming Rock on. Up. I cannot yeah. wait to meet you in person. You're going you're yeah. gonna to knock Can't everyone's socks off. <laughs> thank you so much. All we're excited right. to see you. See ya. All right, take care. All Bye. Right. Later. Bye, have a good one. Bye.